How to Kiss. Whether you've never been kissed or have been kissing for ages, it never hurts to brush up on the basics and learn a few new tips. Consider this the definitive guide on how to kiss. You will need fresh breath and a partner. Step one, freshen your breath. If brushing your teeth isn't possible and mouthwash and gum aren't handy, take a few swigs of water to help rinse away odor-causing bacteria and food particles. Run your tongue over your lips to moisten them. Step two, tilt your head to the right as you come in for the kiss. Two-thirds of humans do, even if they're left-handed, so this reduces the odds of bumping noses. Close your eyes just before your lips touch. Relax your lips so they're slightly parted. No one wants to feel like they're kissing a brick wall. Step three, after your lips meet, let passion be your guide for how to kiss. If your partner seems tentative, keep your tongue to yourself and just peck and nibble at their lips. You can always progress to French kissing later. Remember to breathe through your nose. Studies show that men are fonder of very wet kisses and tongue contact than women, who often complain that guys use too much tongue. Step four, learning how to kiss involves hands too. Put them around your partner's waist or neck, run your fingers through their hair, or to be really romantic, cup their face in your hands. Step five, as you gain kissing confidence, experiment with different techniques like sucking and gentle biting and vary the pressure and tempo. Notice what your partner is doing so you can learn from them. Step six, let your partner come up for air every once in a while. Because when it comes to being a good kisser, knowing when to take a break is as important as knowing how to kiss. Did you know? Men's saliva has trace amounts of testosterone, 